Kevin Bundy, what tale does it take for by conservative members of Congress now bleeding supporters after his racist rant came to life? A New York Times profile of the rancher Hot Bundy referring to African Americans collectively with the term the Negro. Here's some of what he had to say. Go to my Facebook page, Benson Easley the second. Scroll down through my timeline. Listen to the whole content of the speech. So today, Bundy offered a rambling response to this latest controversy during a news conference in Bunkerville. Trying to return the focus back to his battle with the BLM, but there seems little chance of that at this point. His comments are being met with outrage across the country. News Street's Antonio Castellan was at Antonio was pretty nice guy. Bunkerville, and Antonio, uh, some of Bundy's supporters did not like the questions that you were asking. Yeah, he was shouted down by Pete Santilli and some other guy. You can't ask a bad question. What he had to say, he brought it up again. He said he wonders if African Americans are better off as slaves. It was a comparison. It was a miserable. Happy if they were born with their talking about the South, where they come from, they took the lost place for something better. But what does it have here at home? Cattle rancher Clyven Bundy did not back down on the comments he was quoted saying in the New York Times about African Americans, slavery, and cotton picking. And are they slaves when their daughters are uh, having abortions and their sons are uh, uh, sitting in the prison? Fair question. You know, like, like, uh, the cattle rancher stressed his words were misused, and he had to look towards any minority with the and there's also these riots to come. And I, I see one of the bigger left website uh, uh, over the back of press tracks and come and sort of mingle with the, uh, the rest of the community. I've seen that happen. And I, I can tell you the truth. I, I didn't understand. I didn't the boy there. I didn't hardly see a black boy until I was probably a teenager. Several Bundy supporters like this and easily feel Bundy is just misunderstood. It's, I, to me, uh, a choice of words, the language used, is sometimes owned by, whether it be a region or an era in time, you know, um, like, like me calling a refrigerator an icebox. Las Vegas, Frank Cooper tells us it was important to be here to listen for himself what Bundy had to say.